Hello all, I am Dr. Prabhas Sanjanbal. In today's class, we will discuss about the construction of push out automata for some different types of language. Okay. See in the language. See the first question. Construct a push down automata that accepts the language L equals to A to the power N, B to the power N plus M, C to the power M n comma m is greater or equals to one so what is the meaning of the question so here here if we will simplify this question or this language how to get c here a to the power n b to the power n plus m c to the power m now i just divide b here a to the power n b to the power n or b to the power m c to the power m means here number of h and number of c here number of h and number of c is always equal to the number of b number of h and number of c is always equal to number of b means for this question so here how to perform means a will push a will push, B will pop, and B will again push, and C will pop. Means here B will work just like a push and pop operation. Means it's just like a means its role is just dual type. Means uh, push and pop operation both. Okay. So for example, if n equals to two, m equals to three. So that means n equals to 2 means here 2h, m equals to 3 means 5 bits, c equals to 3c. Okay, so here a will push, b will pop, means 2 bits will pop 2h, and 3 bits will push, and 3c will pop this 3b means here b will work just like a push and pop operation in both operation so how to perform these operations this is the push and pop operations then second thing how many states will be required so the number of states here the number of states equals to three means q0 q1 and q2 because after B, A cannot be repeated. Here, after B, after B, A cannot be repeated. So after C, B cannot be repeated. After C, B cannot be repeated. So when we will go from A to B, so we will change the step. When we will go from B to C, we will change the step. So here we will change the step, and here we will change the step. Okay, see how to construct the push down automata. So, here the language is I'm again writing a 5b triple c. So, this is my stack. So the initially the stack contains Z0, okay. So Q0 read first a, then Q0 read a, top of the stack is Z0. This is Q0, a, Z0. First a will push, okay. And the second one, del q0 read the next a q0 read a top of the stack is a equals to q0 a a. This is called push operation. Okay, so it also works like a self loop. Self loop. Okay, now b will when it will read b. B will pop this A. So third Q0 
read b top of the stack is a now i'll change the state because we'll go from a to b so this is q1 pop okay read b it will pop this way the fourth one the del q1 read b read b top of the stack is a this is q1 epsilon so it looks like pop operation means it b it will pop so it also works like a self loop it works like a self loop the fifth one del next q1 read b read b next read b what is the top of the stack here top of the stack is z0 when q1 read b top of the stack is z0 in this case in this stage it will push the b means here q1 b z0 b z0 this is called push operation so now b will push okay so whatever b is will read that will be push the sixth one del q1 read b read b top of the stack is b now q1 b b this is push b means push again when it will read q1 b b it will push there are three bits that will be push okay so it looks like or it works like a self loop it works like a self loop seventh one del when del q1 read c q1 read c top of the stack is here b when it will go from b to c it will change the state means q2 epsilon it will pop it is a pop operation so read fast c pop eighth one del q2 read c top of the stack is b this is q2 epsilon then this is pop operation okay again q2 read c top of the stack is b it will pop it will pop okay so it works like a self loop it works like a self loop so ninth one del q2 epsilon z0 there nothing means epsilon q2 epsilon z0 this is q2 this is q2 epsilon this is q2 epsilon this is pop means it will pop z0 okay so this is the push down automata for the following for the given language okay now we'll see one more question now we'll see one more question see construct a pda that accepts the following language a is equal to a to the power n b to the power m c to the power n plus m here a to the power n b to the power m c to the power n plus m see here, the number of a's and number of b's is always equal to the number of c's means for this language okay let n equals to 2 m equals to 3 means a square b3 means bq 
c to the power 2 plus 3 means 5 okay 2a 3b 5c 2a 3b and 5c okay so my stack is here there zero there zero so how to perform the push and pop operation in this case here same no, number of h and number of b is always equals to the number of c number of h and number of b is always number of c so that means a will push b will push c will pop a means push operation b means push operation c means pop operation okay because number of h and number of b is always equal to the number of c's so that's why a will push b will push and c will pop so how many states will be required so the number of states equals to see here there are three states will be required so three means q0 q1 q2 by using empty stack mechanism by using empty stack mechanism by using empty stack mechanism when we will go from a to b will change the state when we will go from b to c will change the state because after b a cannot be repeated after c b and a cannot be repeated so that's why we will change the state when we will go from a to b and when you will go from b to c we will change the state okay so now we will construct a question this is a a b b b c c c c c okay so the first one del q0 read a top of the stack is z0 this is q0 a z0 q0 a z0 a means push okay so this is push operation the second one del q0 read a top of the stack is a q0 a it works like push and also self loop and also self loop a means your push so third one del q0 read b b means push b top of the stack is a here this is now i'll change the state q1 b a q1 b a means it is just like push b means push fourth one del q1 read b top of the stack is b so this is q1 b b this is push it is just like self loop it works like a self loop b read b push then q1 read b top of the stack is b it will push the fifth one tell read q1 read c top of the stack is here b when i will go from b to c i change the state this is q2 then pop q to c means it will pop this one okay sixth one del q2 read c top of the stack is b then q2 epsilon it is pop and it works like a self loop okay q2 read c top of the stack is b pop then q2 read c 
top of the stack is top of the stack is b then pop then seventh one del q2 read c if top of the stack is a it also pop means q2 epsilon it also pop okay it is also works like a self flow so q2 read c top of the stack is a pop q2 read c top of the stack is a pop then eighth one del there is nothing means epsilon q2 read epsilon top of the stack is z0 this is q2 epsilon this is also pop okay it will pop so this is the construction of pda for the given language okay in the next class we will also construct some means push down automata for some different types of language okay thanks for watching